Filming from GenCon 2014, I'm here with Miranda, who has agreed to tell us a little bit about Era of the Ninja, a game published by Mythical Eras of War Games. Thank you, Miranda. Thank you. Now, Era of the Ninja is a game from one to four players. And in this game, you are a ninja. We have several of them here that you can choose from. Each ninja has different abilities. Some are better at sneaking, others are better at attacking, others have special abilities like fire breathing, being very small to sneak into rooms. So there's a lot of variety in this. What you have to do is you have been contracted to assassinate the lord of the castle. So you have to sneak into his castle, find him, and eliminate him. You start the game with your figure in the middle of the castle, in the courtyard. And as you explore the castle, you build it. You match up the blue dots so that you kind of piece it together. But it can be expanded in several different directions. Mm -hmm. So like on a long skinny table like this, it could go long and skinny. Uh -huh. now, so I like the idea that you don't know the layout of the castle beforehand, so you discover it as you're going and looking for the guy you're trying to assassinate. Yep, so you kind of discover, you can kind of get an idea, like you'll know there's a room oh, off see. this way. And they you don't know, know exactly what's there. behind the door. Yeah. Okay. So it's sort of like opening a door into a new room. Mm -hmm. Now in each room, when you go into a new room, you flip over an encounter card. It tells you what's in there. So it'll be, it could be one guy, like in this one, you put a little guy in there. Or it could be a whole bunch of guys. You could have a whole party going in there. Now when you find someone in a room, you get two choices of how to deal with them. One, you can attack them, eliminate them, and not worry about them anymore. Or you could sneak past them. Either way works for this game. Now as you're doing that, whichever choice you take, if you're successful, you earn these little tokens here called Ingenuity. They are used to buy more weapons, more skills, more items. So the more you sneak or the more you attack, the better your character gets. Ultimately your goal is to find the Lord of the Castle in the castle somewhere and you have to take him out. Now when you're playing by yourself, it's pretty easy. You find him, take him out, you win. Or if you die, you lose. Oh, you can play by yourself. There is a solitaire mode. Yeah, there is a solo mode. It's a, it's a little harder and loss is death. So. Uh -huh. But when you're playing with several people, it's kind of co-op, kind of player versus player in that you can't outright attack each other, but there's only one winner. Whoever kills the Lord of the Castle wins. <laughs> we also have a special set of rules if you want to do player versus player, where you're killing each other instead of... <laughs> Samurai. And the base rules are always the same across each game, but every Lord of the Castle adds a different rule. Mm -hmm. Like one might be super paranoid, so knows where the ninjas are best. Another might be really old and can't really attack on his own, but he has a whole bunch of bodyguards. Uh -huh. okay. So it's a little different each time you play. And so so the scenarios change. work differently because of the various elements that change. Yep. Hmm? Okay, that sounds that sounds interesting. Um, can the players? Uh, how does combat work? That's one of the questions that people always want to know. How does combat work? How do you resolve oh, okay. combat? So what happens is, if you're attacking a samurai or an ashigaru or any of the NPCs, they have an a wound value and a dead value. You roll a d10 and add your attack. Uh -huh. If you hit the wound value, it just hurts them and these numbers go down by one. So if you hit the dead value, they're dead. All right. Now, when they're attacking you, because they can attack you, you have to roll your dodge higher than their attack to not mm -hmm. get hit. Otherwise, you take the damage. Got it. Pretty when, straightforward. And ninja versus ninja, the attacking ninja rolls attack, the defending ninja rolls dodge. Okay, makes sense. Thank you, Miranda, for talking to us about Era of the Ninja by Mythical Heroes of War Game. Thank you again.